Hi YouTube, this is my transaction for Rite Aid and Walgreens for the week of May 6th. So I had $3 in extra care bucks that were, no sorry, $3 in up rewards that were expiring today. As well as two, two $10 register rewards from Walgreens. So I didn't really have any deals, I didn't know of anything, and I didn't have coupons. So I just grabbed three Bumblebee tunas, which were on sale for a dollar each. And then I used my $3 up reward making that absolutely nothing. It was zero. That was that was it for Rite Aid. And then for Walgreens. I went to three or four different Walgreens and the first one I went to I was so happy. I grabbed I plan on getting a Yardley body wash, the lavender one. Then the U by Kotex sleep tam tampons, the complete solution, the witch hazel yeah, I think those five things. Yardley, Complete, which is... Oh, yeah, five things. That's four. Lanacane and the Lanacane, which would have made it five things. And I was going to use my two, 20, my two $10 register rewards, $1 off Complete, $1 off Yardley, because that by then I realized that the coupon had expired for the U by Kotex. I was supposed to pay, I think, $0.97 cents plus tax out of pocket, but it didn't work out that way. I went to the second one, they didn't have the lanacane, they didn't have the tampons, they didn't have the witch hazel. And then the third one, they didn't have the witch hazel, and they didn't have lanacane. But, so I, like I had to just switch my transaction and just settle for whatever because it was getting late. So this is what I got. I got the Yardley, they didn't have the lavender one, so I got the sea minerals. It smells like lemon. That was $1.99. Complete was $7.99. This Witch Hazel is not the one that's $4 and you get a $4 registry reward. This one was $6.49, but it had a Try Me Free on it. So I'm going to fill out the rebate and I will get my $6.49 back, which is awesome. Then I grabbed the tampons, which were $3.99. And these, the Morton Salt... At one Walgreens had some for a dollar something, but these were in the clearance section. I don't know why. For seventy-four cents each, so I just grabbed two, and then this was supposed to be my filler for thirty-three cents, and this is what upset me because I did not pay thirty-three cents for this. I was too distracted, and I paid a dollar nineteen for this little tiny can of tomato sauce that I don't, I didn't even want. I should have just grabbed another salt, but that's what I get for not paying attention. So lesson for today. Or note to self, to myself. I need to know. I need to remind myself to clip my coupons, clip them together for a smooth transaction. Don't talk to the cashier and focus on your coupons. Because I can't believe I paid $1.19. But I'm not going to go back to the store, waste gas for $0.86. Cents. So that's just a lesson learned. So there's my receipt. $7.99 for the complete. $1.48 for two salt. Um, 399 the tampons, 189 the shower gel, and 119 for the tomato sauce, and 649 for the witch hazel. I used a dollar off from the complete and a dollar off for the yardley, my two register rewards, and it came out to be a dollar thirteen and seventy cents seventy cents tax. My total was one eighty three, and I I knew something was wrong, but I couldn't figure it out until obviously I got home. That happens all the time. So that's it. I paid $1.83. I got back $3 for the Kotex and $8 for the $7.99 complete, which was like a dollar and one cent moneymaker. Yep. And oh, I will be submitting my rebate for $6.49. $6.49? Yeah. So that's basically it for Walgreens. Make sure you have everything set. So you won't be regretting. I know it's only 86 cents, but it just upsets me that I didn't have my coupon ready. Like I had it the ad in my hand the entire time. I was going to I was like planning on handing her and having her scan it, but no, that didn't happen. Because I started asking her about the witch hazel and she started telling me how people came in the morning and basically took all the witch hazel. And yeah. That, that's my transactions for Walgreens and for writing these three little cans of tuna. Thanks for watching. Bye, YouTube.